try this a second time. So, it's Motu Joe, and uh, I've got a fun few things here. Uh, this backward shit, you know, drives me crazy. Now I'm Utom Yaj. So I'm sure if Tom Ace watches this, which I just realized he's probably going to love making fun of me on that one, but it's Motu Joe. <laughs> so um, it's been a fun week. Uh, there's been a lot of fun talking about stuff um, in a lot of the groups. Um, some of these conversations are, you know, what to say, what not to say, and that's... Uh, if you have to wonder what to say and what not to say in a live group or a Facebook post or a challenge, then you got some other challenges bigger than that to worry about. Um, but we all make mistakes too. So it's, it's don't, don't think I'm trying to pass judgment here. Um, but we like to talk toys. We like to have some O2 fun. And some of us out there are very excited to see what's coming in the mail from Super 7. That's not quite... They're not being sent out quite yet, but apparently it is coming soon. But um, I'm obviously doing the two phone here. I know I see I've got a watcher right now. I'd like to get a couple more on the hook before I start diving into mm, that pile of stuff down there. And some of one of those things you, you already kind of saw it because it was right on top. But let's see here if I can see this a little bit better on the other phone. If it's showing up a little bit better. Um, but, oh, uh, Wayne, Wayne Robert would ask me about, do I have, uh, any of the mail aways? Do I have any of, uh, any of those particular items? Um, I think he asked about the Ram Man, uh, Zor, um, giveaway. And of course this is getting all janky on me. So hopefully this connection is still live and you are seeing what I'm, what I believe, uh, you guys all can see, but this is getting really weird and probably not fun for you guys either. So, um, we have, I've got some friends, like many of you guys do, in other parts of the world. Um, I'm based in, in, uh, West Michigan. Uh, what's up? And actually, there it is. There's, uh, help me out, please. Is it, is it Madden? Is it Maiden? How, how are you, how do you pronounce it? Because I don't want to, um, jumble it up any any more than just me guessing but i believe it's it's madden um it could with two d's but let me know um i want to i you are one of the main subjects of conversation today this we'll get into the good stuff this is yours madden which is how i'm gonna say it for now um what's up damien uh this box is for you and um I am going to repurpose this. I will let people know that it was from when Mattel did their crazy sale and they put some stuff on Super Sale. Um, I got a couple things the very first time it went on, which uh, I'm just trying. I'm messing with taking a shipping label off. I'm not going to take this out of the box. Um, I'm not going to even tell you what's in there, but Madden, you know what's in there. And um, this is going to get weighed and repackaged. I'm going to put another shipping label right over this bad boy. I did open it just to make sure that they were the correct items, um, which that's all I did. So you can see the foam packed in there nice. I will get this repackaged and uh, it's going to be sent off to you. And that is kind of a, I know Wayne is a, a big, big supporter of doing that as am I. I am I like to help if I can. Um, a lot of us are really busy with our lives and some of us are have a little more free time. But if I have something that I know you guys want or I can hook you guys up with um, or I can get my hands on it, um, I will. I know Michael Vickery has been sending stuff uh, his way as well. He's, Michael just sent me a, a lead on something. You guys find this stuff on occasion where um, I, I miss it sometimes. And it's... Uh, it's really cool that you guys uh, are kind of watching out for us um, and sharing those type of things. Um, but here's a, here's another fun little find. This one, I can't unbox it because it wasn't a box to begin with in the sense of me getting it. So have a Diorbs, have my Merman. Uh, missing a couple of these still. Uh, they're harder to get. Um, I know Wayne knows about a particular deal where I had secured had is the operative word had secured a uh shira and it was only going to be about 35 bucks um we're 
pretty certain the gentleman realized that he agreed to something that he shouldn't have. Um, despite buying quite a lot from him, um, he reneged on the deal. Um, that type of shit normally chaps my ass really bad. Um, I don't, I, I don't tolerate that. Um, and I use that word on purpose because, uh, I, I call, I'll call, I'll call it out if it's egregious. This particular case, I didn't really care, but anyway, Shira, I'm off on a diatribe now. Um, the friends and the support of this community and the friends that we're trying to continue to build in the Motu world, that's what, uh, that's what this is really mostly about. Um, I, I truly do enjoy helping people. Um, but, uh, likewise, if you guys need any of these overseas and you can't find this type of stuff, let me know. Um, believe it or not, I can find it fairly easy here. The chases, sorry, those are hard to find. Um, but I am missing the Skeletor and Shira chase, I believe are, I think I'd be even missing the Merman chase, the blue Merman. So yeah, I'm missing a few of these. So if anyone's got a lead, let me know. I know um, this is something really cool too. Uh, Peter LaRose just posted this on his group, or on the, uh, I think the Motu Nation page. If you guys are looking for any of these bad boys, and again, it's backwards, I hate that shit. But uh, these are the UK comics, and they are actually bigger than the uh, magazine sold here. Not the comic, but the Masters of the Universe magazine that came out for a little bit. They're taller. This is a bigger magazine. Um, look up Pete LaRose. He's got some stuff on the Motu Nation if you're interested to check that out. Um, where the hell's Wayne? You thought you were going to be watching, man. I can't post this shit any better for you. I'm doing it early. I got somewhat an unfortunate luck of the draw here. My, uh, my son's not feeling too awful well, so he... Um, He's just kind of chilling upstairs, but I also have my dishwasher break, so I have a repair guy here. I figured I'd take a few minutes and say hey to the world, uh, show some few things, show a few things. Uh, also, and I already talked about it earlier, but I love my shirt, my Motu Joe shirt. This is cool. I like it. So, um, all right, the other couple things here that I've, we got. Uh, I managed to land two of these. I don't think I showed them in the last video, but... I got two anti attorney He Man's. Uh, he Man. Um, one is is spoken for. One will be available. Uh, so if anyone is interested, I I have my anti attorney right here. But um, I picked these up when Maddie did their sale. Uh, just like Madden had gotten uh, um, what he's got down there, I snagged these couple things. Um, so those of you that don't know Spencer Robinson, he wanted some of these, so I hooked him up with one of these um, anti turnia But I also hooked him up with this. That looks a little familiar, I think, to some of you guys. Uh, this is the box that I opened that wound up not having the, uh, the gun in it, which was obviously very disappointing to me, but... He is going to wind up getting my personal T-Rex, as well as the uh, uh, Dynadrone, as well. And there is no gun, which is unfortunate, but thank you, Spencer. This bad boy is going to Spencer Robinson, uh, along with the an the anti eternia So, trying to help it out, man. Um, he hooked us up, and I say us because he hooked Wayne up, um, with some, some uh, the TLS, the Loyal Subjects, Wave 1 figures. So um, he gave us a, he gave him a better deal than I actually, not that I bought mine from Spencer, but he got it for a less, a lower price than what I paid for my T, my uh, TLS Wave 1s, because um, I bought mine in the store. Um, so you're welcome, you're welcome, Ed, and I'm, I'm super happy that I could help you out. And if other things come along the line like that, you know, please let me know um, if I can help you. Oh, if you're still on, I still, you got on, you asked me about... Um, potentially being able to help with sorry I gotta look through these this is my pile of print materials I got to uh, figure out which one it is um, oh, some of you guys might like to see some of this stuff because this is kind of cool but these are my uh, these are my animation cells we got quite a few of them here um, latest one I got, I got some pencil work, which actually Pete LaRose were selling some of these pencil works too, but got a fist though. 
Uh, this one here at the end. Hand-painted background, too, with Lord Mask and Orko. I like that one a lot. But anyway, that's not why I'm trying to find it. That's just my cells. Um, I think this is just non-Motu. Huh? Sticker sheet. Non-Motu art, I think. No, no, these are the maps. Okay, there you go. Madden, if uh, these are what I have from the German uh, magazine line. I don't have many of them. I think there's well, that's four there. I would really like to get my hands on some more of those. That's it. Those are the only four that I have from the German line. Um, got a uh, Manny Faces fold-out gun, the gumball print ad, um, and then this one. This is a look. This is definitely different. I thought I maybe showed this in one of the first videos I did, but these are funky, man. Those are Chinese uh, comics or storybooks. And, uh, yeah, these are just different. Really like those things. So uh, if you got any of those Madden over in Germany, you know, please let me know. That would be fantastic if you can hook it up. Uh, this other book is um, it's a new toy line, actually, that's in the works, Defenders of Eden. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's, uh, you should you should look into it if you can. This is a, a local guy, Mike Rodriguez, is uh, making the storyline, and he's actually making these toys. Uh, uh, that's I did not misspeak that. He is actually making these toys. It's going to take some time. I know there's some red tape he's got to go through, but that could be another Mythic Legends type toy line that's coming out uh, in the near future. Thank you. Appreciate that, Madden. If you can figure that out for me, it'd be great. A few of those. But, um, all right. So, again, this isn't necessarily as vintage as I think some people care to see. I do have some vintage down here. I'll get to in just a second. I myself was missing this guy. I was really excited that I couldn't believe it. This is from a, uh, uh, someone posted on there that this guy had him. He hadn't done this in a long time. And, um, he managed, meaning Facebook and Craigslist, eBay type stuff. You know, that's all he'd ever done. He had never done anything on Facebook in a long time. Got back into it. And I got that bad boy. Hordak with Imp. Um, again, I did not do one subscription, one year of subscription with Maddie because I didn't like their business practice. I did not like how I was just getting gouged repeatedly, repeatedly, repeatedly on shipping and combos and this and that. And, you know, ultimately they still got my man money in some way, shape or form because I have this heroin addiction called Motu and it sucks sometimes, but that guy is going right there after the video because that's still in the camera view. <laughs> so, um, all right. So that's for my personal collection. Love it. Love to have in that in, in here. Um, okay, here's some vintage, here's some vintage merch. Got this on eBay. If anybody is interested, if anyone sees this and has any interest whatsoever, I do have two, two sets of these, these skates now. That's what they are. Just ruined the surprise a little bit, but... This box is amazing. Look at that. Oh, man. Artwork on the side is unique. We've seen that He-Man before. But this artwork with He-Man smiling like that is definitely different. Um, and we'll take a look inside. The box is in great shape, and this is that real crappy cardboard the stuff that even if it gets a little bit damp in the room it's you're screwed so incredibly dull skates but look at that brand new that's they're they're fantastic they're uh they're in great shape so if anyone needs a pair um i happen to have an extra set um so yeah that's cool um, what, uh, well, then, well, yeah, there's more, 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 more. Okay, so this is going in my collection over here. Uh, all right, vintage. This one 
is a Euro find. This one is not going to be, you're not going to be able to find it here stateside that easily. And it is a notebook. Sold in, I believe it was Spain or Italy. Uh, marked 1986 as Mattel. I know it's backwards, but inside it's a three ring binder. And they hold booklets about this size. And this is also from Europe. This is not available, guys. This one's mine. But this is available. I happen to have two of these. So if uh, anyone is interested, you know, send me a message, send me a PM. We'll figure out how I can get it to you. It's, it's very light. Uh, it wasn't overly expensive either. So if there's an interest in that, I'll happily hook up the Friends Network and see what we can make happen. Um, oh, and then this one here, this one is definitely a little more sought after. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, too, um, that glows. This is the puzzle board, a board puzzle. Uh, it is brand new. It has not been used. I managed to get two of these from one particular person, and the only thing that you can very clearly see is that it got bent. Probably hold it that way. I don't know if you can see the bend mark in it. A little bit, you can see. That bend right through the middle there is less than ideal. But you can tell that the pieces themselves, I mean, it's still unpunched. I mean, that's the, a peg up there. Um, this thing wasn't put together. Outside of that bend, which causes this one little piece to pucker just a hair, uh, it's, a, it's a great piece. So if someone's interested in this too, I've got, I've got two of these. Happy to help somebody out. Um, and yeah. Uh, oh, Wayne, which you're still not watching. You know what? This is the beauty of technology. I am going to send that little bugger a message. I know it's 4 o'clock. I know you get up early. But where the heck are you, man? Oh, it says two people are watching now. I'm going to send you a message, man. Find out what's going on. Uh, of course, this is the old phone. This is the crappy phone. It does not have Messenger on it. So... You will not get a message from me now. You will have to wait to see what I have for you as soon as that's done installing. I already showed the cassettes that came from Wayne the last time. He's going to go over here. But he had asked for you know part of the collection here. Some Sometimes people want to see what other people have. They want to see see what maybe they could get out of their, for themselves, um, meaning checklists. Uh, some people don't like checklists. Some people like to just wing it. Some people like to uh, collect anything and everything. That's me. Anything to do with Motu is me. <clears throat> and also some people like to drink beer, and which I'm all for that, and liquor, but I choose Mountain Dew. I'll happily endorse you as long as you pay my dentist bills. Uh, as, if you ever find this video, uh, Mountain Dew. <laughs> uh... Oh my god, it's still downloading. Okay, so he had asked specifically to see a couple toys. And this one here in particular is very hard to see. I have not removed it from the box. But this is, and, and you can see that there was a little piece of tape on it. That's how it came. This was actually up over. You can even see the original glue. I don't know if you can or not. Yeah, you, you can see the original glue. That's what held his wing up in place to keep it from, from drooping, kind of like that. But time is worn out, and his wing is still upright. But this was the J.C. Penny, or maybe it was the Sears. Uh, I, I can't recall, but this is a Zor mail-away. This is, uh, somebody found an entire case of these not that awful long ago. And, uh, I said Zor, I'm sorry, that's Screech, my bad. Um... A whole bunch of these and flooded the market and kind of skyrocketed in price and then fell back down in price and it's a it's a fun piece i i enjoy that and uh this sucks just so you know try to keep your shit together which i did not do properly before doing this so i will try to see what the hell's going on he says he's online are you watching wayne See, I'm sending you a message via live. This is crazy. So I'm not dis don't no disrespect, but he this he wanted to see this. So I'm trying to make sure you can see it. Where are you? 
I'm live. There you go. What's up? We'll see if he answers. All right, so because I want to keep moving on and I have to actually get on the road here pretty soon, my daughter has girls on the run. She likes to run and do gymnastics, so she is out right now. Um, plus, I also have to reply back to Pete to make sure that he doesn't wind up selling some of those comics I may be interested in from the, from the UK, that is, the UK comics. All right. Um, this is the piece that he had asked about, the Ram Man... Um, Zor mail away, and as you can see here, this this is amazing. Uh, that's still the the original shipping label on it. It's like an inner store type of a thing. Uh, Toronto, Canada, store one twenty five. I don't even. I'm sure we could look into see what store this originally came from. I did open it right there, so that way I could confirm that it was new in package. And outside of me opening the flap like that, that's about the extent I've gone to make sure it's all in there. But it's all in there. You can move his wing up. And right in there is Ram Man. This is the, also instructions, this is another piece that was missing and then super, super hard to find and then boop. They found an entire tub or case or so, like whatever cart of this thing, and they went nuts. And I managed to snag one at a very good and reasonable rate when I could. And uh, Wayne, I think you just replied back. Um, yeah, you said coming. All right, you missed it. I'll have to. There you are. You're on now. All right. So I'm sorry, guys. I know you probably already saw this once. I'll have to redo it for Wayne. Come on, man. That is what you wanted to see. This is your Ram Man Zor mail away. Brand new in box. Underneath that, there's your Ram Man. And on the top, or, uh, or the bottom, sorry. Bottom are the instructions, too. I don't remember. I think this was a JCPenney. Maybe Sears. I get the two mixed up. And then this one that you had missed earlier, that's the Zor. Just by itself, mail away exclusive. And it looks like Peter replied to my comment, so hopefully I've got some new UK comics on the way. And then you also, Wayne, you had, I think you had asked about um, the two-pack, the other two-pack. I think I told you it was Fisto and Buzz Off, or maybe Fisto and Many Faces. The two-pack is actually Fisto and Manny Faces, I'm sorry, Fisto and Buzz Off, and it is... I'll pull it down. All right. This is a white box on that side. <laughs> that is the... I'm 90% certain that this was the JCPenney um, mail away. Uh, the box is open. Um, which I don't mind showing people because it's got some little blue painter's tape in there just to keep it shut. But I don't mind opening it to show people because people wondered, well, what did they look like? Were they sealed? Were they not sealed? What is, how do those things come in the box? And it's a very, very valid question because not a lot of people have seen these unless those that have them. But this is it. That's how they came. Just a very cheapo, I wouldn't say it's the brittle it's not the brittle plastic, but it's definitely not the super soft, pliable kind either. A good little, over time, that thing's going to wear. But that is a brand new, unplayed with fit, uh, Fisto. And inside is the Buzz Off with the uh, aggressive uh, aggressive legs. So, good night, Madden. I will get that stuff sent off to you here soon. Um, and again, send me a PM if I'm massacring your name and not pronouncing it correctly. I apologize in advance if I am. Um, so yeah, there you go, Wayne. That's the, uh, they make, um, there are about eight, maybe 10 different vari variations of this. They're not all in white boxes. Some of them come in brown boxes. I know there's a Hordak in somebody, ver I think it's a Hordak and Leech, uh, something. Um, these two packs, uh, were fairly abundant and this is the only one I have. And unfortunately they're not cheap, which just like anything in this, uh, collecting world, gets pricey and this one's one of the pricey ones so 
All right. Oh, um, Madden, I know you just signed off, but remember, uh, when I send this, I've got a couple little treats for you as well that I've included in that. So going all the way back to the very first contest that I did for if someone can guess what's in that box, um, I still I haven't forgot about you, and I've got it covered here. So that'll be shipped off to you real soon. And uh, unless anyone's got any, Wayne, unless there's something pressing that you kind of want to see or know that I've got here that you maybe haven't seen a close-up of, um, let me know. Um, I am extremely excited to see what happens when you when you get that box. Um, it is it's large, and anyone that knows shipping and knows this international type of game, it's uh, that's crazy. It's twenty. What did I say? It's twenty. 28 inch, 27 inches by 21 inches by 22 inches, and it weighs just over 18 pounds, almost 19 pounds. That, my friend, is being shipped over the pond to you, and uh, I'm excited. So if there's anything anybody wants to see, anything anyone needs, um, let's see, I'll piss myself. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, I think you're going to go live. I don't know... If you want to have a uh, a, a, a um, adult, maybe some Depends. Do, do they have Depends over there? I don't know. Adult diapers, maybe? I don't know if you want to piss yourself on live camera is my point. <laughs> I'm excited, too. Um, I really can't. I can't. I, I am. I'm super excited for you to get the, uh, the items. And uh, for those of you that follow and know, I, Wayne has got a large package being sent over to us, Parcel. Um, and when I say us, Justice Carey is also included in that package. And um, there's going to be some other things um, that... Uh... <laughs> Sorry, a little message came up. Got distracted. Um, it's going to be epic. Uh, you guys know I'm into the merchandise. You guys know I love anything to do with this crap behind me. Um, and there is some merchandise items that are coming. And there's one piece in there that I'm being patient. I don't know what it is. Uh, he didn't show me. He teased some people. They don't even know what it is. I am very curious and excited because there is lots of space here to fill in some gaps. And I am pumped. Pumped. It's going to be really cool. Um, I love the community that's starting to form. Uh, uh, Wayne talked about it. Um, that um, myself and Justice are part of a G.I. Joe group. He's the G.I. Joe freak. I like G.I. Joe, but he, what he does for G.I. Joe is what I am for Mochu. So we play off each other really well um, in that sense. And um, at any rate, um, there's a ton of camaraderie amongst the Joe group. And um, that's something that I think a few of us are trying to work on here. Um, and it's slowly forming. And I'm really encouraged by that. And... Um, you know, like uh, I mentioned, Spencer hooked you up. Um, I hooked Spencer up because he hooked you up with the anti um, I A couple bucks I'll put in my pocket on it because of the nature of how that was, but I'm not. He's hooked you up, so that's reciprocity. It goes down the ladder and up the ladder. It's not just a one-way street. So he hooked you up, so I made sure to hook him up, and um, I want to I wanna keep doing that type of stuff because... Uh, it is just money, but money, we have to make it. And without money to do certain other things, we can't do this. This is a luxury. This is a, this is a, uh, this is a perk. This is definitely a first world problem that we're facing compared to most other people. And you, you keep that in check every once in a while. Cause man, I, I, I don't like being disappointed with my toys. Um, nobody likes being disappointed or being told one thing and then another thing. So, uh, I'm, I love this community that we're forming. And Wayne, thank you again for for spearheading it over there across the pond. I was so awesome that you got to meet Matt. That's another thing, you know. Matt Wilford's a customizer. Um, I'm ordering some stuff from him, but I know he needs parts. If, if parts aren't easy to get, and you're, I know the joke is it's not meant to be a joke. You're on an island. The UK is an island. It's a big damn island, but everything's got to be shipped to you. So um, I'm sending over in this parcel that I'm sending to Wayne. This next parcel, which is supposed to be here. Oh, shit, that was supposed to be here today, I think. No, 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 that's wrong. He shipped it from Italy. There's an Italian package coming that has 
truly, 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 truly one of a kind pieces that I will show my piece, but I will not show um, what Wayne is getting as well. Um, I'll probably show the other guy's piece because I don't know him that well. Sorry, I don't want to ruin it. You're fun, but um, when that piece comes, I'm putting all this together and sending it over to you. Uh, and but that's my point is that I Wilford Matt needed some parts. I'm sending them over. It's it's cool. I didn't. I'm. It's fine. Um, they're sitting in a tote for me. Some. It's not like they were worth a lot of money. So help them out. And um, that's 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 become my motivation and 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 fun with this outside of the group because uh those that know me well know that i am as lo a loyal dog as you can get i i i'm emotionally tied to my friends um things don't go right it sucks it hurts and um i do not want to hurt my friends so this community is getting better and better and i am super excited to have friends and communities and contacts that we can all feed positive mojo off of one another and hopefully that continues to spread we'll have a bad day here and there that happens but knowing overall that we're making strides towards our motu community and our motu passion and helping friends along the way um that's cool that's very 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 cool and i uh i look forward to it so if anybody has anything that they want me to sell them uh i don't sell much of the stuff up here but you never know Mo2 life, baby. You got it. Did you notice, Wayne? I already said it twice, but... Mo2 Joe. I know that's backwards, but oh well. Mo2 Joe, for now. And, um... Anyway, uh, we'll touch base soon. Anyone wants anything, send me a PM, and we'll get you covered. I'll try to send, uh... If there's stuff that you guys want to see a deeper dive in, I know someone posted a recent picture about the, uh... The original Jungle play set, but that was just a prototype that they found a picture of in the Power and Honor Foundation book, which I have as well. So, anyway, I've rambled on now for 15 minutes. I have to go pick up my daughter here pretty quick, and um, love it, guys. Love it, love it, and I uh, look forward to seeing you in the very, very near future. Peace. It didn't work. We'll try it again. Peace, too.